Hey everybody, I'm Crow. Welcome back to Legend of Grimrock. I, I almost said enter the gungeon again. I hope I didn't say that in the last episode. I might have said enter the Grimrock, I don't remember. But we need another torch, because this one can die. And then we put one on. One of these was, we've, we've been in two of these before. That's the torch. Okay, so for this one, I was informed that a character can throw things farther than you manually throwing it. Do we have we have a rock still. I'm gonna move these up here just for now. And I'm gonna go one, two, three, flash. One, two, three. Wait a second. Perfect. And we got our fancy rock back. And you got your poison bolts back. And there's a book in there. The last time I got a book, and it looked like that book, I got 25 extra health. I want it. I also want more torches, because we're getting pretty low. Oh, what did I do? Oh, I hit the thing right. Does this one also drop down the pit? I wonder if that's just another way back down. What does this give me like this gives me time to go through obviously but do I have to have something pressed on this like I'm a, when, once this starts going up I'm gonna step off it okay yeah, yeah. okay now stepping back onto it makes it go back down okay freeze nope there is multiple. You jackass, give me your arrows. Really? An archer just walked out here to fight me? Ah, he has all the dodging skills. There is a lot of skeletons down here. You need to drink one of these. I don't know if this hits both of them. I think it does. So what are you gonna do? Other than walk into my death spells. Come on. I got you. Dead. Bolts. Bolts. Two more quarrels. Why are they called quarrels? Burrow Rat Shank. I'm just gonna call them bolts because crossbows shoot bolts. Okay, there's nothing on the walls here are actually like pressable. Healing item. That must mean there's terrible shit in here. And we are out of uh, energy. I was like, what is this and why do I hear these noises? What terrible creatures await. But now we can make a healing item. You guys both still have yours. Cool. So she has one now too. Anti-venom. Hopefully other things too. Because anti-venom's neat, but not everything poisons. So... Health and energy seem a bit more practical at times. Got another torch. The ever-burning kind, apparently. And now we get ready. Because they are definitely coming. Okay, so not these ones. How about these ones? Yeah, we had enough of that. And it hit the ones behind them. Yeah, no. Ah! They've surrounded me. Critical! Oh, you're out of bolts. I'll shoot these. 25 damage. Sweet. You gonna go over there, or you gonna come over here? Critical! I can just keep... Ah, you actually got me. Okay, maybe I can't just keep doing that, but still, we got our four back. I think that was Enchant Arrow. I wonder if that also counts for bolts. I would very much like for these bolts 
to be amazing. So we're gonna try it. Put that over there. Uh, I don't think she has enough, actually. We're gonna wait on it. Did these do two damage? Yeah, okay, so it, it doesn't reduce the actual damage of the uh, projectile to enchant it, which is good. I'm kinda sick if it did. Is that a, you have to fall into this? It looks like it, and then that just opens the door out. But now I know that there's like a key over there. Something to fall into. It looks like there's a lot of different spots to fall here. That's, that's gonna be something. But first, let's check to make sure we got everything down here. We pulled that lever. This is not open from this side, but there are ways to drop down in there. I can tell we're going to need to do lots of stuff with holes in the near future. So, if we come back this way... Then there's blue warpy stuff. And now we're back up at the very beginning. I see we have some walking to do. Oh, oh I, I thought I hit it and I was going to drop myself again. It's not that one. I hit it. Give me. All right. Oh God. No, neither of these work. It wasn't this one. You just have to find the right one of these to drop into. So we weren't even in the area for that one. So if we drop down over here, we need to get dropped down into that room, most likely. So maybe that was the one around that corner right there? And I just needed to run a little bit further? So let's check that one out next. So let's... Let's see. Sleep! Because this is not the health levels I want to be running at. We could die pretty much any time. Just from too many holes. Imagine that, falling to your death. All right, so now that that's fixed, we will go back into this one until it's done. I think we were almost done with the second one too, but I want to finish what we started. We already got the torches. Oh, there's a button here. Oh. Give me that. Oops. Secret spotter. We were two, and then the wall goes that way, and then it goes over. So if we walk through there when that happens, and then walk this way, and then went over? It sounds like we're making progress. Chitin mask. Nine protection. The pot of a giant beetle larva is carved into a primitive face mask. I wouldn't want to wear that. But these people are a lot more adventurous. So give it to her since she's the only one without a hat. I'm sure that evasion's probably more useful for them than... Oops. That's not a map. Probably more useful for them than actual protection because they're not going to get very tanky. But at the same time... I want that rock back someday. But at the same time, it's like... It's like something. I don't know where I was going with that. I got lost in thought. I hit the button and I was like, I have to do things now. Oh, you bastard. Oh, we got him somehow. Oh, are you kidding me? That last one, it stops right here, so I can't fall into that. Huh. Even if I walked all the way right here, it would drop me down before the room. But it looks like these ones over here... Or these two right here, they would also drop me back down in here. So that wouldn't get us anything if we went that way either. It has to be something down here. I don't understand how you get over there. Is this a different one? Nah, this takes us right back to the same place. We're gonna get it. It doesn't look like it, but we're gonna get it. Alright, so that took way longer to find than it should have. After falling down here and trying to go through about every damn hole ever, there's a button right here. You just throw something over the gap. That's why there's no trap doors here. You can see it. 
So you should probably do something about it. And then it works. And then you pull the lever. And there's more enemies. But this is open, so who cares? We got into the next area of the puzzle. And we got rid of that old spear we don't need. Whoa, why did I double back? Scroll. But never forgiven. Are you really gonna... Yeah, you are. 90! Oh good, our bolt's still here. Yeah, it sucks to... Oh, I shot into it, never mind. Well, we have to go in now. Dang it! Alright, so you just want to jump into holes. That door should still be open. All in all, it's not a problem. I at least want to get one of these done. I'm not ending an episode without major progress. Probably, I mean, we're, we're definitely going to end them like that in the future. Uh, right? Because that other room was there. This one? No. So if this was this one, then that was probably that one. I needed to drop onto the left side because I need to fall into this room. If only it was a little bit closer. Alright, so while my dogs were barking, we already tried this one. And I tried this one. And it didn't look like I was going to fall into either room. So we could potentially reach those back rows by throwing things. And we still need to check this one and this one. But just in case I do need to throw things, we're just going to check so that we don't have to make another extra trip up here in case we need them. But that one over there and this one right here, so let's check it out. Hopefully something happened. There's a torch back. There is a torch back. There's a torch back. And the other torch bag. So all of these four over here and these four other over here are the holes. Which means this one is... Oh, you have to get the center to drop out so that you can fall into this room. So there has to be something else in there to try and... I can see the puzzles are getting harder. The false sense of security, it's fading away. I might need to invest in that light spell, because just walking around... I mean, I know we still have a lot of torches. I would like to have a backup, though. So she needs four more points. So maybe just the next level? Because, mm, actually, she would get a spell if she put all the points into that. I don't remember which one it was, though. That teleports me back out. Is there a button on the wall around here? Nope. Nope. And no. So throwing things to these... Mm. This closes it from the other side. Why would I be able to close it from the other side? No reason? He's out and about now. I see that there's a button over there. But I don't see how to get there because any of these four just drop me down. And I've dropped into, like, every other hole out there. I don't think there was a way to get around this. We can't do anything diagonal. What does this scroll do? But never forgiven. Throw it in. Okay, that didn't do anything. I've checked every wall in here, and I cannot for the life of me figure out where there would be anything anywhere to press. So I'm just going to assume that there isn't anything anywhere to press. And we're just going to do one of the other ones. This is probably the end or something. Or if it's not, if that area wasn't a dead end, I'm just going to assume that someone will help me in the comments anyway. So the more you know. Either way, we're back here and we saved. So thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you liked it. Later, everybody.